Right, hello everyone, I am the man, welcome. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Welcome to Aperture Desk Job. Now, um, before we get started, I do not have a Steam Deck. This is regular old PC with an Xbox controller. We're gonna see how it is. If I ha if it's not optimized for regular controllers, oh well. Welcome to the Aperture Science Competence Center for our most gifted employees. I'm Cave Johnson, and if you're hearing this, you are exceptional. No, don't be bashful, it's true, no false modesty. Let's get started. Look at all those tubes, stretching off in the distance. Every one of them's taking something important to a genius who's gonna use it to change the world forever. A genius just like you. How are you gonna change the world? Well, that's up to you. History will remember what you do here today. Do not let us, and by us I mean all of us, all of humanity, down. So congratulations. You are about to take part in the greatest science adventure at the greatest applied sciences company on Earth. This is important work, and you are just the genius to do it. God gave you these gifts. I'm giving you the opportunity to use them. Well, here's your lab. I don't mind telling you, we're excited up here. Moon landing excited. Newton, Einstein. Wait a minute, that's, now you. that's not right. I think I put the wrong tape in, hold on. Good luck, world's best science. Okay, here we go. You, in the overalls, get to work or you're fired. They don't give out overalls anymore. Anyway, my name's Grady. You can call me that. I mean, let's do introductions later. You should really already be... <sighs> Honestly, I'm surprised you're not fired already. Anyway, uh, you are a uh, ba -ba -ba product inspector. Oh, boy. That is your inspection desk there in front of you. You will be inspecting... Uh, okay, uh, doesn't say. Anyway, something... It's going to come down the conveyor belt, whatever it is. Make sure it works. Oh, you that, my God. Keep doing that. That's the whole job. Anyway, just remember, the important uh. thing is to have fun on your own time before you come in. Otherwise, it's just, I don't it's it's real bad here. It's fine. You'll probably be fine. Good luck. Hey, wait. I have questions. Oh, God. I don't think this is optimized for regular controllers. What? My dream job has come true. God. This is the entire game, everybody. I hope you're all happy that you clicked on this video. I have a feeling this is not going to go Damn well since it. I... I knew it. I left the volume down. Hold yeah, on. Zip, zap, zap. That is how you inspect a toilet. I hope you were paying attention because I'm not saying any of that twice. Look, it's not rocket science. It's not even toilet science. Here's everything you need to know. See that light on the wall? If that light goes on, you're fired. <sighs> okay, good. You heard the important part. Wait, wait, hold on. Have they all been smoking? You know what? It's not our job to test if the toilet's on fire, right? Just do your regular thing like normal. Move it down the line, and then it's somebody else's problem. Uh, oh, okay, oh, well, how do I do that? You think your job's bad? I mean, your job is bad. It's just... Do you oh hear that? God. Hold on, I'll, let me take a look. Yeah, keep testing it. I think there's a jam in oh. Holy shit! Can you get me out of here, please? Um... Nope, I'm just wet now. <laughs> no. No, 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 that, it's working, keep, please, it's working. Huh? Oh, holy shit. 
Oh my god. Just test it. Get it out of here. So, first off, I uh, think we're in a lot of trouble here. Yeah, no shit. I also think we're going to be rich because I think you just admitted something. Okay. Here's oh, okay. what we are going to do. I'm going to go work on this in secret. Just you go back and pretend to go back to work, right? Like it's yeah. got to look good. I mean, yeah. just pretend the most you've ever. You know what? Just go back to work, actually. Yeah, that works. Uh oh, okay. I'll be back. Cool. Ah. Oh, looks like I'm, uh. What? Oh my god, the mantises are getting smart. They're gonna take over the world. Six months later. I'm still testing toilets. Still testing toilets. Hey, I'm back. Yeah, I'm back. Uh, first off, you did awesome pretending to calibrate all those toilets. The best. Alright, are you ready for this? Presenting... Press, you gotta press the button. Presenting... Pre presenting the Aperture Science Turret. Go on. Take it for a spin. The controls are ready. Yeah. And I haven't even showed you the best part. Here's the best part. Shooting. You know what, though? I mean, you're definitely going to kill yourself with it pointing at you like that. So let me just turn it around. All right. Oh. Shoot again. Don't worry. It's safe. I mean, this time. This time it's safe. Last time it wasn't. You almost died. Yeah. Go on. Wow! Holy moly, man. That is great! Oh, man. The turret broke. That was the only one, too. But don't even worry about it. Because here's what I've actually been working on. Is this going to be the new TF2 item? Introducing the Mark II. This is what oh I spent most God. of the six months on. It was one month for the first turret, and then like five for this bad boy. Oh man, you gotta take my picture of this. Uh, the desk should have a camera built into it. F12? I took a screenshot! <laughs> moment recorded for all the history books. Now for the fun part. You are gonna take it for a spin. Here, let me turn it around. Okay, normally I'd walk you through everything, but I think you get it. Let's just open everything at once and see what happens. Oh, okay. You're crazy. All those controls do something. Wow, right? Is this going to be the new TF2 weapon? A part fell off, okay. I'm a mall out of... Oh my god. Is this going to be the new TF2 gun? Keep shooting. You're not doing this. This is a structural engineering problem. It's on me. You're doing Oh fine. my god. I don't think this is how this is supposed to work. It even looked cheap when I bought it. I remember looking at it like, ah, spend the extra dollar. And yep, here we are. I... Uh, oh god. Well, about that. Ah. Uh. Wow. All right. That. So some of the stuff I put on there just didn't work. Most of it, like ninety percent, or even higher, maybe. But some of it worked great. So all we have to do is keep the great stuff, and then we, then we can... So, okay. That's the police. So, one oh. of us needs to streamline this turret, right? Yeah. And one of us needs to take the fall for shooting up the warehouse. Because they're, this is a lot of damage, and they're going to look into this. Which job, which job do you want? How about I fix the turret, and then you take, yeah, I'll do that part. Remember, if anyone asks, you don't know me, okay? Okay. Don't 
say anything. I won't say anything. Those mantises are gonna take over the world, I just know it. They're already built a city. Oh, I'm in prison. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh, a rat. Hey, well, I mean, wow. You are the best. Thanks for keeping your mouth shut and doing your time. You're welcome. I mean, it was way more time than either of us were expecting. I don't know what was in those boxes we blew up, but they were wow. Were they mad? Yeah. Anyway, I promise you're not going to regret this. Now let's get you out of here. Okay, good. The offender has faithfully observed the rules of the institution. Offender has been granted supervised early release. Please sign for your possessions. Inmate's possessions are as follows. Desk. One. Inmate must state their name, print their name, then sign their name. Oh, God. Uh, I'm Albert. Uh, inmate's name is now preserved for the permanent record as. Uh, I'm Albert. That actually worked. That's weird. <laughs> Moving on. Now, type your name. Uh, oh, God. Type your name. I am, bitch. Listen to her. You don't need to worry about reporting to your parole officer. Guess who spent the last 18 months getting his probation agent license through the mail? Yep, me. That's right. I'm your parole officer. Hooray! I mean, not just you. I'm managing like seven guys on parole right now, but they're basically reintegrated back into society. Well, not Tony. He's struggling a little, but. Oh, anyway, poor Tony. That's all I was doing. I got something to show you. Let's get out of here. Oh, okay. Okay, thanks. Oh, uh, bring your desk. Okay. Ah. Uh. Oh, no mantises this time? I okay. my turret while you were gone. Introducing the Mark III. Ta-da! So I got rid of all the parts that fell off and just kept the stuff that worked. I mean, it was totally over-engineered, so it just does one thing now. It shoots. It didn't need a satellite dish. That was just dumb. Here, try it on these appliances I found. They were just lying around in the housewares research department. Oh, okay. In a locked room. Oh. L lovely? It's just like the Mark Oh, shit. Oh, God. Like this is you fucking know. awesome. Did you do it yourself? It's like a, is it a dragon holding a knife? It's nice. The more I look at the tattoo, the more Please let this be a real TF2 bones. item. Please, for fuck's sake. Am I the only one that wants this to be like a damn engineered turret? Man, I want to hear. So cool. Oh, speaking of being cool, I've Stop got flying everywhere. better to show you. Gyroscopic controls. It's real easy. Just pick up the desk, tilt it around to aim, and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. And you shoot with the right trigger like normal. Go on, try. It. How much did the tattoo hurt when you gave it to yourself? Did you have the proper tools? I would bet not actually. What the hell's on that screen? You probably had to heat up a pin with the lighter or something. That sounds, I mean, that sounds pretty awesome. 
Another tattoo idea I just had, instead of a robot hand coming out holding a wrench, what if it was like a skeleton? You know, so you're looking at it like, what's he trying to say? Is he human on the inside, or does he have like a skeleton trapped in him? You know what? A skeleton on tattoo. I decided. That's the one I want. So when we get I, I honestly have no idea what the fuck this guy's even talking about. Alright, everything checks out. This thing is perfect. I think we're good to go here. Okay, good. So, I was saving the best for last. Okay. While you were in jail, I got us a meeting to show our turret to Cave Johnson. That's right, the owner of the company. Who? No pressure, but if he likes this, he's going to make us rich forever. Forever? Are you ready? No. Let's go. Okay. Oh my god, the man's What the fuck? They really are going to take over the world. Okay. Ah. Uh. What are you going to do with your share of the money? I'm going to give me a steam deck. <laughs> the money I borrowed to make this turret. Like immediately pay it off. Or I'll, I mean, whew, I'll be in some real trouble. Plus the VIG, I'll have to pay that too. <sighs> Does it make sense to you that the VIG is more than what I borrowed in the first place? It doesn't seem like it. That's weird. Somebody overrode the controls. Hold on. I stole from housewares. Oh, oh, what geez, the fuck? It's an ambush. What do I do? Man, he got that turret good, huh? Good thing I brought a couple spares. Oh, that's oh, it's a boss battle. Okay. I knew it. It's the housewares department. How did they find out about our turret? I can't believe it. they stole our idea and. Well, that's aperture for you. Yeah, true. This is fun. I like this. Die, you stupid washing machines. Not gonna lie, this is actually really fun. Yeah, there's a lot of them. Why is there a deer head? Housewares, man. Can you believe it? Those guys are such pieces of... What did we ever even do to them? Well, you're the one who stole the appliances and made a turret out of a toilet. My fucking face! Nice work. Oh god, I can't see. Hand. Stop! Oh god, I can't fucking see. Yeah. Should have some buttons on the other side of it. Those fire the rockets that got built into the desk. Oh, okay. Now, for safety reasons. So. Automatic death alarm sequence are engaged. Here we go. Oh god. Okay. Oh. Ah. Oh no, my desk. Okay, really nice work. Good shooting. I think we're good from here. They probably gave up. I have given up by now. <sighs> okay, let's go show this thing to Cave. 
Also, I do have one quick confession. I didn't actually get an appointment with Cave Johnson. I lied about that. Oh, but okay. It turns out, I didn't know this. It turns out nobody's seen him in years. I did know it when I lied to you about our appointment, but it was still pretty new information. Anyway, I'm not gonna lie to you anymore. <sighs> I think he might be a millionaire recluse now. So be ready for that. There might be a lot of jars. Hello, Mr. Johnson? Let's just go in. Mr. Johnson, are you here? Hey there. It's me, Cave Johnson. No, no, not behind the giant head. I am the giant head. I'm gonna level with you. A few years back, I got real sick. Body riddled with disease. I was a goner. Threw every dollar I had at it. Told those eggheads, hey, eggheads, make me live forever. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers on Earth a blank check to make you immortal, and this is what they came up with? A giant head? <laughs> Off by a mile, no. They figured out how to put my consciousness in a computer. That's what's in the giant head. Their first plan was to put me in a regular brain-sized computer. Then they'd put that in a robot body and, hey, presto. Well, turns out you can't fit an entire human mind in a computer that small. All I could do was tell time and know what my name was. So they kept making it bigger. Big enough to cram every last bit of me into this thing. What happened to my robot body? Still under the head, somewhere all crushed up. Couldn't support the weight. So the lab boys put me in the big head, switched me on, and... Uh, I don't know, I panicked, killed a few of them. Said I'd kill more if they ever came back. Honestly, I, I regret that now. Anyway, that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Get their butts up here and end my suffering. Now, oh, don't worry about me. It's been a full life, but we're done here. I'm itching for the next step. Heck, I'm excited about it. Okay. Don't even think of it as killing me. You're breaking me out of prison. I'm just data now. I need you to crack this big clay head open so I can spill out into the universe. So, what do you two eggheads got? Uh, you, uh, you are in luck. We actually came up here to show you our new invention. Good stuff. Let's see it. Show them, partner. Well. Whoa! That'll work. To be honest, I thought you were two lunatics who dragged a toilet up here. But you are. <laughs> Geniuses. He called us geniuses. Oh my god. We need to find his weak spot. Son, this thing's made of clay. It's all weak spot. <laughs> oh shit, it's actually working. What the fuck? What? You are made of metal, sir. So shoot the metal. Oh no, my turlet! Hey, you see that? I think that's his power source. <laughs> oh, really? There you go. Powering down. The great beyond. Boy, I'll, I'll give you two credit. That is one hell of an invention. Bye, Gabe Johnson. You, you figured out how to end my suffering. All right. Suffering ended in three, two. Ah. Backup power activated. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, you're both fired. <laughs> I'm going to need your key cards. Just lay them down in front of the head. Not too close to the chin, or I won't be able to see them. <laughs> God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, I, th I think he's dead. You know what? It just occurred to me that the only person 
who knows Cave Johnson asked us to kill him is now dead. Yeah. Do you know what the punishment for murder is? They told us in parole officer school, you're not going to like this. Uh, it's life. Your whole life in prison. We should. Yeah, we, we, we should leave. Don't okay. touch anything. Oh, oh okay. And bring the desk. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh no, the mantis is new! Months later. Morning, Charlie. It's me, Gary. Gary, your boss. Keep inspecting those toilets. Good work, good stuff. Good. Hey, it's just me, Grady. Yeah, just like yesterday. Man, this witness protection program is great. I don't know why we didn't turn state's evidence against those loan sharks in the first place. We don't have to pay any of the money back. We got cool new names. I like yours a lot, by the way. You know, come to think of it, you'd think they'd move us to another state or give us new jobs or something. Feels like everything is exactly the same, except our first names. Ah, you know what? They know what they're doing. Anyway, see you tomorrow, Charlie. Uh, uh okay. Is that it? I think that's it. What the fuck? Oh my god. That was it. That was actually pretty damn good. I like that. I like that a lot. That was really fun. Oh man. That was really fun. Sadly I didn't I don't have a Steam Deck to fully under to fully play this and the way it's supposed to be played, but hey, that's alright. This is a good game. I like it. I liked it a lot. I don't know if there's anything after the credits. Um, this song is actually pretty fucking catchy, not gonna lie. But yeah. Let me know what you think of this. Have you guys played it? Do you have a Steam Deck? Let me know. You guys you guys don't have to have a Steam Deck to play this, by the way. You can play this with normal Xbox controller. It works. So... Thanks for the use of their face. <laughs> ah, it's a cake. The cake is a lie though. Anything? Anything else? Any secrets? No? This game's just gonna close. I think the game is just gonna close. It's all black. It's all darkness. Just like my soul. Um. Uh, yep, that's it. Oh wait, what happens if I? Oh, that'll be like some sort of weird secret thing. Anyways, I and the man. Hope you all enjoyed this. This was really fun. I and the man. Goodbye. Stay tuned for more.